not hand sanitizer. It's all good. We're hey, covered. Can I have some, I have some of that? <laughs> What's I, that? You, you want me to distribute it to you? One. Could you? What? Wait, wait. Is this even? It's plugged in though. You need to like. That's not hand sanitizer. Well, I saw Jewel use it before. Oh god. No, I swear I saw Jewel use it before. That's an air freshener. Why was it using an air freshener before? Jewel versus um John numbers. Now I'm. Wow, this is a very explosive start. I mean, I guess he's at 71% 71. already, and John not is not going to the ledge. <laughs> <laughs> you know, seconds, bro. from the last game, we saw that um, Jen, I mean, not Jen, I'm so sorry. John was kind of just stuck at the ledge because he put himself in that situation. Oh, the back air, I was waiting for that back air, but he didn't want the back air, and that's gonna. Oh, unfortunately, didn't have the right mash shot on that. Wasn't able to do it fast enough to get through that F tilt, but thankfully, he's still gonna live surprisingly. Low on resources with no Levin Sword or Uppy, but he's going to be able to air his back properly. And the fun fact, whenever he uses a uh, neutral beat from a jump, it lifts him up slightly. So it changes how he has momentum and how gravity affects him. Kind of like with Joker and using Aha, how it makes him drift Very nice more in the air. air. Compared to having none of that. Oh, 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 okay. It was supposed to spike on that, but Soccer Ball collided with him, so uh, Soccer Ball got back. Ah! Okay, oh, thank God. you. Thank you, Joel. I really needed that. I needed to wake up. Thank you, bro. Uh, uh, ah! <laughs> like, how else can you describe that besides just pure ah! awe and amazement? I guess. It's I implicit, know, but it, it's just cool that. to see. It's cool to see. But still, John has been untouched this entire stock so far. And he is just trying I mean, to as, as he much should, as he, he can. Um, he's definitely not spending a lot of more time on the ledge as he was in, in the previous set. Which is understandable. He literally got clogged for... Oh, oh. there's a down air. Double dip. But no, don't even need to double dip. Wait. Uh, oh, yeah, no. He didn't no. want to save them. Wait. That or... Wait. Yeah, okay. I'm assuming that over the fact he didn't have L wins, right? I, mean, I think he did. Yeah, he still has Okay. But yeah, that's understandable on both fronts. But unfortunately, we're back in the same scenario as Burt for second stock, with Jewel being at a slight disadvantage in terms of a percent. Let me sort of be able to pass him. Also, another fun fact with Sun Salutation, there's a small wind box on it, and it's larger the more you charge it, obviously. So, but it, it, like, it seemed like it might have collided with the Loving Sword, it pushed him away with the Sun Salutation. Oh. <laughs> Like, I love how Jewel's able to just constantly utilize everything to the best of abilities. Loving Sword's done? Alright, I'm gonna throw it at him. Uh, this book is no longer of use to me, I'm gonna throw it at him. Dang, that trade was not favoring a. Uh, was that F-Tilt? That, that was, was F-Tilt. Okay, yeah. F-Tilt. Yeah. Collide with the up air, unfortunately. Adjust yeah. your posture. Professional gamer Jonathan Digits must adjust his posture to get this run back. Jonathan999. Jonathan999. Where's 999 come from? Um, because he played Ben999. So oh, basically oh, both he did? Numbers. Oh. Yo, let's go, Ben. Let's go. Dude's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Is we fit ball the only projectile that reflects when you parry it? Um, it doesn't reflect actually. You parry it, does it? Well, I mean, it doesn't reflect, but it bounces off of you. I think it's because of the fact that it has the same properties of an actual volleyball. Like, it would bounce. Like, but at the same time, though, like, if you shield, it's weird, if you shield something like Samus Charge Shot fully, then that will bounce off the shield as well at an angle, but not from the parry. And this game has weird item shenanigans, I mean, I don't, I don't know. Speaking of item shenanigans, that's what Jewel is currently pulling out on John with an amazingly huge lead currently compared to the last game. As I say that, though, he did, like, half a percent to make it back to that. Oh, but catches, but for spot stars from the up air and gets a little bit of a cute combo from it. Nothing huge due to damage from knockback, but it's good from the sour spots. I am very oh. curious to see what would happen if John started crouching more when he's in close range with, I mean, I mean very it, serious. It wouldn't because help he, him for, say, it wouldn't help him for, um, uh, uh, arc fire because the fact that it would reach to the bottom to the floor. As we know, um, well, I'm sorry, as we know, like, you know, we fit, I'm pretty sure we fit has the like lowest crouch in this game. Nope, it's Kirby. Uh, okay, okay, I'm sorry. Um, You're second fine. lowest. He forgives you. Definitely has to be second lowest because that that is very close. It's very low. Yeah. Like that would be one of the um, shots John would use to get under um, Palutena's um, jab. Oh, not jab near. So I'm just wondering, just like if if um, what's it called? Um, it would it, it would kind of go under um, Jules' nair, or just oh. use it in close range because it makes it really <laughs> harder for. 
really harder oh, for. There's um, the crouch we're talking about. It okay, worked but, out. Like that was not in mid range, and he just he just sucked them up and just freaking took all his health, his life. Oh, do another one. Oh, oh, it was so close for it. Okay. Dang it! I wanted the down air. Mm. Yeah, but he was in no reach to really be able to get that. Ah! And he got it from the 11th one toss. He was oh. that fast with the grab. Oh. That was cool. Wow. Thinking of being fast with the grab, soccer ball into the grab, fast on both ends. They're both quick with it. You gotta be quick with your stuff. The stuff, man. You gotta be quick with your stuff, the man. The stuff. The, the hands? The interactions? From the ledge? You gotta be fast with your stuff. Oh, and it's really scary oh, huh. for John and this percent to really interact with something like Artfire on Shield because of the fact that if Jen's if Jen if Jewel is close enough, then it's a free. It's, been in on. it's a f what do you have what to say? Sam? Hmm. Anyways, I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, excuse me. It's a free nose for Ratu if he's close enough on Shield because in this instance he's blocking the Shield stun from Artfire being a multi hit. So it's a free command grab, free percent being come back, and then John gets a taste of his own medicine for getting percent being healed back. Except, like, he literally tastes it because it actually does damage, too. Oh, speaking of damage, that's what That was Vats, 194. That's what that's going to do to him, yeah. <laughs> uh, that was 194. Oh. All right, getting shipped from the arc fire. It, like, you have to know exactly how to push that on the ledge. Like, knowing what, what distance you have to throw it at. So this way, it, like, lingers off the ledge as well, so it drops down. Kind of like with how holy water works with Belmonts. Yes. Ooh, QP reversing. Space seems to go away. We're putting out some projectile pressure. This stuff on John. He's always perfectly timing the shield when it comes to charging his neutral B away from projectiles. Like, like, like you see, there's a zoning at close range. I love it. Oh, okay. Look at the back air covering that from the from the arc fire. <laughs> Kirby's center of mass is literally on the floor. That's I I have to laugh at that. That's kind of funny. I'm so sorry. <laughs> No worries. If it's about Kirby, it's, there's no need to apologize. What if it was any other character? Hello? Then you have to apologize. I'm... You know what? <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Anyways. Hmm. Okay, he's got the book out, and the book went out. Like, like the book checked itself out from the library. Oh, but so did that stock wow, from that... taking... I mean... That... No, uh... Sun Sigmentation. Both stocks as well. Full of charge, too. Ooh, okay. I mean, we could definitely see um, Jewel win this, but <gasps> Yo, I know. Up it? Yep. <laughs> Bro, as, as you can say, as you as you just said, you can see him winning this because he did win it. Because he, he did. Just got clocked. Because he did win it. He just got clocked. <sighs> oh my god. Good timing on your end because he, he, he sealed it. He hurt you. He said he could win it. He said no, I will win it, and he did. I mean, we're. I, I'd love to see. Ooh. <laughs> I'd love to see. I'd love to see. Jewel clock, Je I mean Let's John go. a lot more. I mean, Let's I mean can, go, Jewel. can we see this? I want to see this. I love to see when people get clocked. As long as it's not me getting clocked, I love to see it. <laughs> I don't like doing it, but when they do it, that's when it's funny. No, I just don't like it when it happens to me. Anyways, the back. Oh, that was very nice. I looked like he. Um, yeah, he died in, so I feel like he could have tech that. Yeah. Been able to tech that just because um I mean yeah, he, he could have died away. It. Yeah. But yeah. he did, it looked like he died in because that's just, you know. And he just took the headbutt of a lifetime. No, that's um what's it called? The spike. No, like, like the spike is a headbutt. That's literally you have you if you've ever seen a volleyball player, they they put everything into it. Yeah, like, so that's like, I guess that's where they head and their arm. Like, uh, the whatever. Headbutt. We don't care that it's a headbutt. Hello? The headbutt is where the spike box is, I think. That's what I'm saying. Anyways. <laughs> oh, Yo! wow. He still got hit with the volleyball anyways. Dude. Dude, the item combos from that parry as well. Oh. Yo, covering it. Okay, covering the jump <gasps> with the book oh was such a smart idea from Jewel. Knowing that he couldn't get the extension from the up air. Yo, what the heck? He just... <laughs> what was that? <laughs> that was just cute. Like, nothing damaging, nothing really demoralizing, but that was cute. I just like it. Bing bong. Like, like playing ping pong with himself. He was playing... Much. He was playing ping pong with himself, essentially. <laughs> and he did the same setup again from last game. Oh, my God. Uh, apologies to Devin's ears. I'm sorry, bro. This combo was going so far out right now. 33% on the I'm board. so sorry, Jen. I mean, um... Devin, oh my god. We're sorry to you too, Jen. I'm sorry. He's out. There's no need to be sorry. He's no, out. No, like, you had to fight John walling him out for two games in a row. I feel sorry too. Actually, you know, that makes sense. See? I mean, See? I don't know. I wouldn't really feel sorry about that. <laughs> Y'all acting like I don't got limiters on your mics. Ah, <laughs> uh, then we're not Amateurs. sorry, dude. <laughs> you too professional for our sorry. 
for our apologies. <sighs> okay, keep bringing up back on lock, but Jen, I mean, Jewel still has a good lead currently. Smart on numbers knowing not to stay above ledge for too long because he knew that Jewel could cover him with an aerial. Ooh, Love and Sword, that's gonna do some damage and some knockback. Plus, giving Jewel back some stage control and allowing him to get back on the stage from the ledge. Oh my gosh. Wait, like hold on. I kind of want to see that parry again. That no, parry looked a little bit cool. The quick item play on both fronts. They're both throwing things out and they're oh, both wait, deflecting hold it on. so well. Like, look oh. at every. Like, they're just throwing everything at each other. It's so cool seeing that all. And, and, like, from a distance, it can just like, oh, they're just throwing stuff at each other. You're not really thinking. But they're constantly parrying things properly. They're constantly aiming things differently. Oh, and that's a beautiful that look of her. That is dead. Yeah, she oh, did. Oh, God. She did. Can we see Jewel take this set? Oh, my Lord. In the quickest of fashions. The okay, not the quickest of fashions. Woo! <laughs> just stepped over the volleyball. Like, no, you can't play with it. I can only play with it. If I don't get to play with it, then no one's to play with it. It just, like, steps on it and pops in the blast zone. But that wouldn't be fun. Well, that's how she is. But volleyball is fun. <laughs> she's not having fun. She's not letting anyone else have fun. She's a trainer. You're not supposed to have fun. You're supposed to work and improve. And, you know, it's no that fair. Fun. Look, listen, there's no pain and there's no gain if there's no pain. But it's no fair if she doesn't feel any pain in the process, okay? Because where's the gain in that? That's she gains literally, percent. Literally, I love this. She gains oh percent from not Goodness feeling so pain, from healing herself. So where's the pain in that? How come she's gaining? That's cheating the system. No, it's not. She's a trainer. No pain, no gain. But she's not feeling any pain. She's feeling anything but pain currently. Except when she's hit with a Blush well, Charged Straight Sword. Maybe then it's a little different than not pain. Hey. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Yeah, no love and sword. Oh, so the... go for spike. oh, my God. That was. I love when someone reacts to a freaking roll read. It's so funny. Oh, <laughs> no. I love oh that. Good my God. That was so good. Let's go, Jen. Hey, let's go, Joel. <laughs> That was so good! The late hit of a reverse up air into the back and confirming the kill with the Leaven Sword. Cleanest of plays coming from Jewel, securing the win for set and this week's Xeno. Congratulations!